Hello, my name is Daniel Knighton. I'm an application engineer with Listen, and today I'm going to show you how to measure a smart speaker. The elements of this test are going to be our AmpConnect ISC audio interface, which is going to provide a power amplifier to drive a source speaker. We're going to use the source speaker both to control the device under test and also when we measure its embedded microphone. In addition, AmpConnect is providing the interface and power for our measurement microphone. The measurement microphone is going to cover the response of the device under test. And for today's demonstration, we're going to use an Amazon Echo as our device under test. Finally, of course, I have SoundCheck running on my laptop to control the entire setup. Okay, for the first part of the test, what we're going to do is we've uploaded our test stimulus to Amazon's music service and I've recorded myself generating the command word that will prompt a playback from the device under test. That test sounds like this. Alexa, play test signal one. Playing test signal one from your library. And you can see that once the test is completed, we have the frequency response of the device under test, the distortion, and also the perceptual rub and buzz. We could actually return any standard measurement parameter from this device, understanding that the way we'll carry out the test is to upload our stimulus to the appropriate cloud service, record a command phrase that causes the device under test to play it back, and then we're in fact capturing it with a triggered record-only acquisition. For the next test, we'll measure the microphone. The microphone measurement in this case is simpler. We're just going to capture the frequency response of the microphone and its sensitivity, but actually conducting the test is a little bit more difficult because in this case what we're going to do is play back a frequency sweep that we've equalized to be one Pascal across 100 Hertz to 10 kilohertz, but that is in fact going to be recorded by the device under test and we then have to retrieve that recording. In this case we're going to use Amazon's web service to do that. Alexa So now I've set up this test sequence to prompt me to go to Amazon's website and in fact play back the test signal. So what we've done here is a little bit more complicated, but in the net we get the frequency response under test. In this test we trigger Alexa to start recording by playing out the command word followed by our actual test stimulus. On the computer, I've installed a virtual audio cable, which captures the playback from Amazon's website and routes it into SoundCheck, where we're then able to capture the actual frequency response of the device under test. Thank you very much. Please feel free to contact us if you have any questions or would like to see a demonstration of this in person.